math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat to simplify this expression. So to do that, you have to know the quotient rule, which says uh, if you have a to the m over a to the n, that's equal to the a to the m minus n. That is to say you subtract our exponents. If the result's positive, it goes in the numerator. If the result's negative, it goes in the denominator. So I'm going to start simplifying this by breaking this expression apart into two parts. Like so, this becomes 9x squared y to the third z over 3yz minus uh, 12xy squared z squared all over 3yz. So the first thing I did is broke this into two separate expressions. Now I'm going to simplify each of these using long division and the quotient rule. 9 divided by 3 is our long division. That's simply 3. There is no x in the denominator, so we're just going to leave it in our numerator. Right here, we have y to the third over y. So y to the third over y. Technically, there's the first power here. So this is y to the third minus 1, or y squared. So this is y squared. And then we have z over z. z to the first power over z to the first power is equal to z 1 minus 1 z to the 0. z raised to the 0 power is just 1. So in other words, it just disappears. Subtract it. 12 divided by 3 is 4. Again, there is no x in the denominator, so just copy it down. And then we have uh, y squared over y to the first. That's y to the 2 minus 1, which is just y to the first power, which we're just going to write as y. And then we finally have z squared over z, that's z to the 2 minus 1, which is just z to the first. z to the first is just z. So we just simplified this one. It's 3x squared y squared minus 4xyz. Uh, so this one is going to be c.